Hello everybody, this has got to transform them all. As promised, it is Friday. I have my Cosmic Eclipse booster box. I am very excited for this for many reasons. One, uh, this is a brand new set, so it's just very exciting in general. Two, I haven't opened much of this yet. In total, I've only opened 10 packs. Uh, four blister packs and then the two three-pack blis promo blisters. So there isn't much I have for this set. So it's all, like a lot of the commons, uncommons even, those are all going to be new. In addition, as far as like hollows or better goes, I have no hollows for this set. So any hollow will be new. Uh, for ultra rares, I just have Wishy Washy, the baby's trio of Cleffa, Jigglypuff, and Cleffa, Igglybuff, and Togepi, and the uh, Silvalli GX. And then for character cards, I just have Stoutland. Any full arts or better will be new. Any character cards that aren't Stoutland will be new. And hopefully any GXs that aren't the three that I already named will be new. So we can avoid the ones I have. That would make this a pretty perfect booster box. Uh, as far as what I'm hoping for, again, just hopefully we don't hit one of the ones I have already uh, for GXs or the character cards. But otherwise, I would like to hit one of the golden trainers or the golden secret rares. Just any of those would be fantastic. Not much else to say. Let's just go ahead and open this. <laughs> Again, very excited. Oh, another reason why this is exciting. I'm actually on time somewhat with this. Because the set only has been out... I mean, I'm recording this on a Monday night. That's November 4th. Is that today? Yeah. So I'm recording this on November 4th. You guys will be seeing it Friday. Uh, so from when you guys are seeing it, this set's only been out for a week. <laughs> uh, when I'm recording this, it hasn't even been a week. So, yay for actually being timely with this for once. Because I, I checked my Unified Minds uh, box upload. I did that on October 16th. Which, only a couple weeks before this released. So, that was very late. As, so, as so far as, like, getting that up. Like, as a new release kind of a thing. To say the least. But here we are, Cosmic Eclipse Booster Box. We'll start with the... Let's start with the left side. Why not? Without further ado. Oh, we got Charge Con and Bulbasaur, the big Bulbasaur plush. Uh, for a Booster Box opening, these are the two I have. So, first pack, fingers crossed. We can get some good pulls. Oh, goody. Code cards are facing that way. There's a code for you guys. Pause and take it if you want it. I will be trying to make sure I give you guys at least half of the uh, code cards from the booster box. But I am going to try and keep some for myself. Just FYI. Uh, we're going to start the first pack with a Skrelp, Pikachu, Stuffle, Ponyard, Litleo, Mallow and Lana, Clay, and Primplup. Reverse. Starting it off with a character card and a hair from the cat. But we got a character card in the first pack. That is a Magnemite. Very, very nice. I do like this one a lot. Which is Lieutenant Surge shining up his Magnemites. Don't know how happy that one is. <laughs> very, very nice first pack right there. The rare. Is a Blacephalon. Hold on. That's all, yeah, that's a hollow. I actually, so this was the code card I just gave out. Let me just start for proof. I wasn't expecting, I was expecting a non hollow because the green code card like this is usually the non hollows. So that's interesting. I'm like, I mean, I, I like this because it means I, I'm probably not going to just know by the code card what's coming. So that's pretty good. But that's our first hollow. Well, actually, that's actually a really good first pack, though. Magnemite trainer, or Magnemite tr uh, character card and the Blacephalon hollow. Put those there next to the Bulbasaur. 
for the recap at the end of part two. But that was a very good first pack. I'm wondering if that means there's only just like the one code card in these things. I don't know. We got a Tepig, Alolan Sandshrew, Snorunt, Coughing, Drillbur. Definitely some new commons there for me. Uh, Cosmoem, Mawile, and Dusclops. Reverse is a Vibrava. That is an uncommon. The rare is a Drampa. And that is a non hollow. Yep, Blastoise and Pipmop mixed. <laughs> so, yeah, once again. Pretty much as long as we don't hit the uh, the wishy washy baby trio or the Silvalley GX, any other ultra rare we get will be a new one. And of course, any hollow pulls are new by default of just not having any beforehand. Start this pack with a Snorunt with a little Pikachu snor uh, snowman there. Uh, Rockruff, Deerling, I'm very happy to see this. Like this in Saucebuck. Just very happy to see him. Uh, Teddy Ursa, Golwood, Thorough, Tangrowth, and Lily's Full Force. Reverse. Cosmog, that is a common. And the rare is a Cradilly, that is a non hollow. I do believe I've pulled the reverse hollow of that in one of the 10 packs I had before. Got the Sinnoh Legendaries on this pack. Four and two. Because of the card that will never be named. <laughs> we have Trap Inch, Sveal, Passimian, Rowlet, Lilypup, Araquanid, Thoreau, and Dartrix. Reverse. Litleo, that is a common. And the rare. Is a Braviary, non hollow rare. So next, back to Lunala and Solgaleo our work. Oh, that was a, that one was a white code card. So could it be that first pack was just an error? <laughs> I don't know, we'll, we'll find out, I guess, Deerling. Golet, Dewpiter, uh, Apom, Onyx, Roxy, Professor Oak Setup, and Pyroar, Reverse, Glalie, that is a rare, so very nice, rare reverse, and the actual rare is a Sunflora, non hollow. Yeah, I don't know if this means they goofed up the, like the code cards or if there's some new strategy I'm not aware of for how the code cards go in the boxes or in the packs rather. Now there's another code though. Once again, pause and take those if you want them. Hopefully get something good from them. Next up, this is... Uh, we'll start off the next pack. We have Passivian, Pawniard, Lilio. Like this is Passivian. Coughing, Nose Pass, Rotom, Type Null, and Heracross. Reverse. Onyx, that is a common. And the rare is a Victini Hollow. Very, very nice. Second Hollow of the box. Happy to see it. Once again, all the hollows we get are pretty much going to be new unless we somehow double up on one. <laughs> I think, which I think can happen. It's just not likely. I mean, I know I've pulled two of an ultra rare in a box before. I just can't, I can't recall if I've had that happen with an ultra rare. All right, no, I've had it with an ultra rare. I can't recall if I've had it with a hollow. Uh, we got a Magnemite, Eevee. Love baby, Sneasel. I think that's the, if I remember correctly, this is the first water type Sneasel. 
which is very interesting. Uh, now to draw energy, unidentified fossil, and rapidash reverse sphiel. That is a common. I get is that that's a different sphiel, isn't it? There's two in the set. Okay, the rare is a Fion. Non-hollow rare. Next up is another Arceus Palkia and the Alga pack. And again, I'm pretty sure the like correct pronunciation is Arceus. I've just always said Arceus. And yeah. <laughs> Flip baby. Yeah, there's the other Sveal, the upside down one. Uh, Natu, Palp Toad, Jango O, Misty and Lorelei, Tag Team, Pyroar, and Hakamo O, Reverse, is an Ambipom, that is an Uncommon, and the Rare is the first Ultra Rare of the box, a Blastoise and Piplup GX. Very, very nice. I'm very happy it's uh, the first one, at least, is one I did not have yet. So very, very happy with that. Yeah, very happy with that. Put that in the pile with the ho uh, hollows. Once again, for, the, for that recap at the end. And the thing with this booster box, because it is, like, for a newer set... Uh, and I have opened basically next to nothing of this. Uh, like, most of this is new to a point that I'm not going to, like, recap every single new card. Uh, unlike the Unified Minds box, which is, like, there's only certain cards I was looking for, and I had the lists for everything. So, at the end, it's just going to be a hollow and better recap. Uh, we got Flip Bebe, Sneasel, Natu, Trap Inch, Spiel. Lily's Poke Doll, Dragonium Z Dragon Claw, and Araquanin. Reverse. Hello, and Sandrew. That is a common. And the rare. Ursaring. Doing some. like training up on some rocks there. That is a non hollow. Mixed up with Baby Trio. I do really love uh, that one. Like that, that's possibly one of my favorite GX like pairings or groupings, I guess, because there's three of them. Uh, yeah, that was very happy to see that one. Uh, Spiel, Conmy, Rowlet, Phantom, Oh, and Grimer, Vibrava, Probopass, and Iglybuff. Reverse is another character card. This time it is Wishy-Washy with Lana there. So very nice second character card of the box. Still hoping we don't hit a Stoutland. If, if there is more, and I think we might have at least one more in the box, uh, hopefully it's not Stoutland, because then they'll all be new, and that'll make me happy. The rare is a Weavile. Which I don't believe that's the first water type Weavile. I think for Weavile, there was one in the Diamond and Pearl era. Uh, but for Sneasel, it's the first one. Another code for you all. Got four and two. And next pack is going to start with a Skrelp, Pikachu, Teddy Ursa, Nosepass, Litleo. Golduck, Pangoro, and Heracross. Reverse. Great Catcher. Trainer Uncommon right there. The Rare. Is a Slurp Off. One of my favorite Gen 6 mons. I know there's people that like don't like, I'm sure don't like the, uh, like the ice cream, like food or whatever mons. I like it. I'm I'm fine with vanilla uh, and all all the, that line, and I love Swirlix and Slurpuff, and I'm totally fine with the idea of it. Like just food Pokemon, like 
we have an animate object Pokemon since Gen 1. I don't know why food is drawing a line for people. Anyway, next back has a Rowlet, Phantom, Glowing Grimer, Magnemite. Like, see, there's an inanimate object one. Magnemite, it's just ma a magnet. <laughs> uh, Eevee, Jolteon, Pangoro, and Rapidash. Reverse. Pikachu, that one's a common. And the rare is a Lycanroc Hollow. So very nice. Another new hollow, because once again, they're all going to be new unless we double up on one. <laughs> I think that's three hollows and only one ultra rare. Because the, uh, because the, what are they? The character cards come in the reverse hollow slot. They do not count towards that, like, hollow and, or better count, if that makes sense. So you can still, you can, for uh, average booster box, you should have 12 hollows or better. The character cards are counted as like reverses. So like you can get the 12 hollows or better plus the character cards. So I'll be curious how many of all that we'll have at the end. But we have an Azurl with the little stitch artwork. Rufflet, Oddish, Ralts, Sandy Gast. One of my favorite Gen 7 mons there. Uh, Flareon, Iglybuff, and Will. Reverse. Lillipop. That is a common. The rare is a Weezing non holo rare. Next up, the baby trio once again. I'd be totally fine with pulling like the rainbow rare version of that. <laughs> oh, oh, I, I, I'm not gonna lie. I saw something poking out there. Let's see what we let's see what we got. Alo in the elf Ralts. Passimian, Changmo Ho, Rowlet, Mimikyu, Beastite, I've never seen that trainer, and Lily, Reverse, Azuro, so that's Stitch Artwork 1 in Reverse Hollow, and the rare is a Vile Plume GX. That is very nice, featuring Erica in the background. Very nice. Another one I did not have, so fantastic we haven't hit a duplicate with the two we've pulled already. Obviously it can still happen, we've got like the other half of the box, but I'm happy at least so far we haven't hit the duplicates. Also we're going to start this back with Perfect Pokemon to go with that Ultra Rare. We've got an Oddish. Oop, <laughs> nearly completely dropped that. Ralts, Sandy Gast, Sfeel, Cottony, Red and Blue, Tag Team, Ends Resolve, and Mawile. Reverse. Phantump, that is a common. And the rare. Mimikyu. There's two Mimikyus in the set. Like, I, I, I don't know why I realized it with this rare that I've probably pulled at least twice already. Like, if anything, it should have been with the one in that pack that had the other one. Like, I don't even, like, where even was it? Yeah, there we go. I don't know why this one didn't make me realize it, because this was the one I knew was in the set. I don't think I realized there was two of them. Or I didn't really know there were two of them. So, now I do. Or at least I've realized it now. Give you guys another code. Four and two. Next pack, third to last for this part. We have Cosmog, Ponyta, Crab Brawler, Carvana, Chinchow, Ambipom, Golduck, and Will. Reverse. Is a Clefairy. That is a uncommon. Okay, that's a surprise. Clefairy's almost always been commons <laughs> in recent sets. Uh, the rare. Ooh. Volcarona GX? Alright, that is very nice looking. 
And again, I, I, do, I love just seeing some different Pokemon. Getting some love for Ultra Rares like this, like Volcarona. Like even back in, uh, what is it, like the black and white days, Volcarona didn't get an EX. It's just very nice to see you getting one now, in GX form at least. And another new GX, which is even better. So second to last pack. If I'm remembering right, we have already hit the like six hollows or better for this half of the box. So I don't believe we have anything left for the other the last two here. I could be wrong, uh, but we'll just see. Magnemite, Lillipop, Trap Inch, Sneasel, Spiel, Rotom, Erica, and Jolteon. Reverse. Island Challenge Amulet, Uncommon Trainer, the Rare. Marshadow? That is a non holo rare. I'm trying to decide if it's like sucking on its finger or like shushing the Pikachu. Like, don't tell anyone I'm here. <laughs> I don't know what it, I don't know which it is, but final pack. Let's see if we can end on anything. Give you guys another code to end on. And the final pack for this half has a Crab Brawler, Carvana, Chinchow, Azuril, Rufflet, Flareon, Roller Skater, and Clefairy. Reverse. Teddy Ursa, featuring the Arceus statue in the back there. That is a common final rare. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Oricorio GX. Rainbow Rare? I still don't understand, like, this particular choice. Like, why only this certain Oricorio? Like, what about the other three? <laughs> like, why, why, why just this one? Like, why not make it, like, a four-way tag team of Oricorio? <laughs> I don't know, but... I'll take this for sure. That is the ghost type form, I believe. Not sure. I can't remember the name. It's like Sensu, maybe. That might be it. Or it might be the psychic one. I don't know. Like the name, at least. I know this form is the ghost one. But that is very, very nice. And a great way to end the first half of the box. <laughs> so... That is it for part one. Thank you guys very much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for part two. Have a great day.